There are multiple reports tonight that New York City's sheriff and his office are under investigation. Sheriff Anthony Miranda's office apparently facing scrutiny over cash seizures made during the raids on illegal weed shops. And Miranda himself is reportedly under investigation over claims he allegedly solicited donations for an organization he heads in exchange for looking the other way on targets being investigated by the sheriff's office. Fox Live's Arthur Chien has the latest. What they're smoking, the chemicals that are put onto these things to make them more potent. That's what makes it more dangerous. New York City Sheriff Anthony Miranda's profile rocketed since taking the job more than two years ago. His agency, in charge of enforcing court orders and seizing property, landed him in the forefront of the battle against illegal weed shops. But the sheriff himself is now reportedly at the center of a corruption probe. According to multiple reports, the city's Department of Investigations is looking into whether Miranda solicited donations for an organization he heads, the National Latino Officers Association, in exchange for looking the other way on targets being investigated by his sheriff's office. Mayor Eric Adams Tuesday responded to yet another investigation into his administration by voicing his full confidence in Miranda. They have handled over $78 million in illegal cannabis. I got a lot of confidence in him. In addition to reports investigators are looking into Miranda, there are also several reports the DOI is looking into allegations his office improperly seized cash during its raids on illegal weed shops. At a hearing last week, City Council Member Justin Brannon asked Miranda about cash seizures during raids on unlicensed cannabis stores. Has any sheriff's office employee during any inspection of any of those shops ever seized any cash? During padlock to protect operations? Yeah. Um, I do not believe so. While Miranda has been associated with some controversies during his career, none of them seem to be as serious as what he now reportedly faces. On the Upper East Side, Arthur Chien, Fox 5 News.